where Uncle Bert reads books. We will start with The Very Hungry Caterpillar by Eric Carle. For my sister Krista, The Very Hungry Caterpillar. In the night of the moon, a little egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and pop! Out of the egg came a tiny hungry caterpillar. I know the feeling. He started to look for food. Do, 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 do. On Monday, he ate through one apple, but he was still very hungry. On Tuesday, he ate through two pears, but he was still hungry. On Wednesday, he ate through three plums, but he was still hungry. On Thursday, He ate through four strawberries, but he was still hungry. On Friday, he ate through five oranges, but he was still hungry. Poor guy. This looks like one of my meals. On Saturday, he ate through one piece of chocolate cake, one ice cream cone, one pickle, one slice of Swiss cheese, one slice of salami, one lollipop, one piece of cherry pie, one sausage, one cupcake, and a slice of watermelon. And that night, he had a stomach ache. Oh, oh. The next day was Sunday again. Just like yesterday. The caterpillar ate through one nice Green leaf. After that, he felt much bigger, better. He's feeling better now. Do, 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 do. Now he wasn't hungry anymore. And he wasn't a little caterpillar anymore. He was fat and big. He built a small house, called a cocoon, around himself. He stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then he nibbled a hole in the cocoon and pushed his way out. That's him fat, and that's him in the cocoon. What happens when he pushes his way out? He was a beautiful butterfly!
The end. Thank you for joining Uncle Bert's Corner, where Uncle Bert reads.